family will enjoy light, fluffy Carolina. The extra long grain rice, naturally rich flavor, naturally nutritious, naturally better any way you serve it. And Carolina's as fast as any to prepare. Tonight, serve delicious beef rice casserole. Recipe on package. Carolina. The extra long grain rice. Don Davis with the news. We'll be right back on the J.O.B. show on this Sunday morning, 24 degrees, 8 a.m. on WMCA, your good music station in New York. This is Don Davis, and I have news for you. This report brought to you by the Bowery Savings Bank, a member of the Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation, and by Rheingold Extra Dry. Rheingold is as good to your taste as it is to your thirst. The weather outlook, clouds moving in, snow shovels later. Complete WMCA weather scope after the news. Police security forces are still maintaining a tight ring around the Unity Funeral Home in Harlem, where the body of Malcolm X lies in state. Some 2,000 people stood in line yesterday to pay their final tribute to the black nationalist leader despite bomb threats which came in. American pilots fly B-57 bombers against the Viet Cong in South Vietnam for the first time. I'll have that story after this word from Bowery Saving. It pays to say that the Bowery, so start your savings account, fly away. Save more and borrow less. Save for your happiness. Save at the Bowery Savings Bank. Do you know how much grow power there is for your money in the Bowery Savings Bank's current dividend rate of four and one quarter percent yearly from day of deposit compounded quarterly? Open your grow power savings account at the Bowery now. Another first in South Vietnam. American pilots are at the controls of American jet B-57 bombers flying missions over South Vietnam for the first time in the war. Until now, the only time American pilots flew our planes were on strikes on North Vietnam and on red supply lines in neighboring states. Propeller craft only had been used in South Vietnam. Some House members have spoken out against proposals that the United States negotiate itself out of Vietnam. Latest voice, New Jersey's Democrat Cornelius Gallagher. Connecticut's Thomas Dodd minced no words on his views either. Our withdrawal from Vietnam would immediately confront us with an agonizing choice. If we decide to try to defend what is left of Southeast Asia against the advance of communism, it will require far more money, far more men, far more American blood than we are today investing in the defense of Vietnam. What is more, it would involve a greater risk of the major escalation which we seek to avoid. If on the other hand, we decide to abandon the whole of Southeast Asia to communism as some of the proponents of withdrawal frankly have proposed, it would result in the early disintegration of all our alliances and in the total eclipse of America as a great nation. Senator Dodd was answering those senators who proposed U.S. withdrawal from Vietnam. A bulletin just handed me, thank you, Dave, France has agreed to cooperate with the Soviet Union in pressing for an international conference to negotiate a settlement of the Vietnam conflict. Information Minister Alain Perifit has just made this announcement in Paris. I'll have the WMCA weather scope after this message from Rheingold Extra Drive. There's a lot of living being done, a lot of living and a lot of fun, where true beer lovers meet along the Rheingold feet. Rheingold is as good to your taste as it is to your thirst, cause it's brewed extra dry. Rheingold is as good to your taste as it is to your thirst. So get where the living's being done, and where the action is, and all the fun on the Rheingold side of the street. Along the Rheingold feet, Rheingold is as good to your taste as it is to your thirst, cause it's brewed extra dry. Rheingold is as good to your taste as it is to your thirst. Rheingold after Rheingold. 
Checking our WMCA weather scope, increasing cloudiness this morning, cloudy this afternoon, snow developing late in the day or night, possibly turning to rain during tonight. High today in the 30s, staying that way on into tomorrow. Winds are from the northeast at 6 miles an hour. Humidity 62%. The current WMCA temperature reading, 24 degrees. Top news of the hour, the bulletin just came in. France agrees to cooperate with Soviet Union in pressing for an international conference to negotiate settlement in Vietnam. New York and Chicago police on the alert as the black Muslim, black nationalist tension mounts. Don Davis with all the news by all means, brought to you by Rheingold Extra Dry. Rheingold is as good to your taste as it is to your thirst. And by Bowery Savings Bank, the nation's largest mutual savings bank. More news at 8.30 on The Good Guy Show with Joe O'Brien. This is WMCA New York. Swing it with the good guys. to get some coins to throw into the fountain when this awful little man grabbed my wallet. What did you do? Well, I went back to the hotel and took a tranquilizer. How much money did you lose? Oh, a little in cash and $200 in American Express traveler's checks. Did you call American Express? Yes, first thing in the morning. They were just around the corner. I got the $200 back that day, and you know that was the... Don't night. let lost or stolen money ruin your vacation. Carry American Express Traveler's Checks. The safe money, safer than cash. Prompt refund if lost or stolen. Buy American Express Traveler's Checks where you bank. They cost only a penny per dollar. And they're good all over the world. Traveler's Checks, another worldwide service of American Express. The company for people who travel. Hello. Good morning. Bonjour. Bonjour. Hello. There are many ways to say hello, my friend. Greetings to Massapequa. Good idea, Ben. Hello, my friend. How do you feel today? Bonjour, mon ami. Night, Ben. Hello, my friend. Hola, mi amigo. It's time for my favorite radio announcer. Oh, thank you, lady. Joe O'Brien here until 10 o'clock this morning. And your other favorite, Harry, will be alone then, you know, lady. 24 degrees, nice and sunny, but it'll cloud up later. If you hate me after what I say, can't put it off any longer. The Four Seasons. <laughs> 